Wow, hello my people. Thanks for subscribing to my channel. Your wish has always been my command. Thanks always. Well, meanwhile, this is another one. All right, this is another one. Well, on this one, it says 11 photos of companies allegedly owned by Bola Hamed Tunumbu Jagaban of Lagos. Okay, Bola Ahmed Tunumbu is one of the most regarded Nigerian government officials. He has extraordinarily impacted both locally and internationally. He was conceived on 29th March 1952 in Oshun State. His mother, who name, his mother, whose name is Mrs. Abibat Asake Mogaji, was the previous eologer of Lagos during a lifetime. He is likewise called the Jagaban of Lagos or Ashwaju of Lagos. He wedded Mrs. Oluremi Tinumbu, who is a servant representative, one of the regions in Lagos. He is a Nigerian legislator and the public head of the All Progressive Party. Okay, and as it is, Bola Ahmed Tinumbu gained his essential instructions in St. John Primary School, Araloya, Lagos, and Children's Home School in Ibadan before he continued to Chicago State University, where he considered and sacked a four year certification in accounting in 1978. Additionally, Bola Tinumbu became Lagos State Lead Representative in 1999 to 2007 when he gave the political noble to his replacement, Babatunde Raji Fashola San. Be that as it may, the previous legislative head of Lagos worked for one of the most extraordinary America organizations like Arthur Addison, Deloitte, Askings and Sales and GTE Services Corporation. In this article, I will be demonstrating you the 11 organizations purportedly possessed by Bola Hamed Tinumbu and I would like you to tap on the like and follow for more delicious substances you can share as well. Okay, number one of these properties, Renaissance Hotel. Number two, a Papa Amusement Park. Number three, Mayegun Land Project. Number four, a far better consulting company. Number five, Ikeja Shopping Mall. Number six, Radio Continental. Number seven, Oriental Hotel and Suite. Number eight, The Nation's Newspaper. Number nine, Royal Garden Estate, Lagos. Number 10, First Nation Airline. And number 11, Lekki Concession Project. That's it, Lekki Tour right now. Well, this, all these have been said to have been owned by the Jagaban himself, Bola Ahmed Tinumbu. Okay, you will recall that not quite long, a lot of Lagosians, after what happened at the Lekki toll gate, they came out in their numbers to destroy most of the of his property, most of his properties that they believe belong to Jagaban himself, simply because some of their men were killed and they believed that the perpetrator of it who must have sent these people to kill Nigerians is no other person than Bola Ahmed Tinumbo himself. Because of that, a lot of people angrily, a lot of mobs have now angrily jumped every corner and directed, they have now directed themselves to destroy properties that are assumed to have been, to have belonged to Jagaban himself. Looking at the news that has been going viral, the so-called mobs have mobilized themselves in different parts of Lagos. And this, I began to ask questions that why was it that these people are destroying every major properties in the country? Well, 
in fact most especially in lagos right now and then um, with the report i gathered so far i now noticed that they have been doing this because of the life that were lost at that to lucky toll gate sporadic shooting at the lucky toll gate and a lot of them that were even you know leading the group were the people that their brothers were killed in the process and uh, it was discovered that tvc tv tv continental television station on the mainland belonging to Bola Hamed Tinumbu was raced down early hours of this morning. And then um, another BRT was also raced down with fire by some guys who reported that their brothers were killed. Also along the line, there was an hospital that was also raced by fire. I think it was a lagoon hospital. Yes, at the early hours of today, reason being that when the protesters, some of them, according to what had been gathered, when they took their loved ones to the hospital, that they rejected the, their loved ones by the gates. And because of that, people were like, so you people are still rejecting. The next thing, they set that hospital on fire. Well, a lot of things actually happened which has made a lot of people to react that if this man had known he wouldn't have given the instruction that people should leave toll gates because now they are attributing it to the fact that this man would have sent them this is lagos for you nigerian youth are no longer happy with the situation of things for the past two weeks and they are now saying that do you think we don't know what we are doing now does it want to sound as if our protest for the past two weeks want to be in vain instead of you people to answer us the next thing you started killing our brothers well a lot of people have like thank god even at that because some of them were like they would have been killed because they were all together when this incident happened that it would have happened to anyone it would have happened to anybody nobody is only nobody was then only us at that moment well the good lord will continue to protect this nation that is the prayer we've been praying to us but my own take right now is that let the federal government listen to the cry of nigerians is all this thing they are clamoring for i can see is for the good of the people vanity upon vanity all is vanity why can't you just release to them what they want and i can as we can see these people are not asking for too much and that is it they are just asking for what rightfully belong to them why can't you just answer them and let peace reign and that is my take on that meanwhile some people have said that why can't you people, why can't the youth channel their movement to the federal government instead of facing Bola Ahmed Tinumbu? Well, a lot of them have said that they are starting from somewhere. But our prayer is that the good Lord should make this country a better state. That is our take on that. Meanwhile, let me have more takes from you on this one. And remember to subscribe for more updates. Thanks and God bless.